An incident here in Gurney could have taken a very tragic turn yesterday morning. Gurney police telling us students from a neighboring community walked into a restaurant wearing ski masks, carrying water guns that looked like real firearms. Police say a group of high school students wearing ski masks, displaying water guns resembling real weapons, entered a restaurant. They targeted other students who were eating, attempting to spray them with water. An employee at the Point Pancake House at Skokie Highway and Riverside Drive told us the incident happened there on Tuesday morning. Police say an adult with a concealed carry permit mistook the situation for a real threat, and the situation could have escalated quickly. Similar incidents in suburbs throughout the Chicago area. St. Charles police sharing photos on Facebook, reminding students never to use realistic looking fake guns like these for a game. Police there saying they've responded to multiple 911 calls from residents witnessing people dressed in hoodies or masks, sneaking around homes, and their officers respond without knowing if students are just having fun or someone is about to commit a crime. Arlington Heights police acknowledging students there play the game. The village of Bartlett is aware of students planning to start the game this weekend. And in Homewood, a police response was triggered by teens with water guns chasing each other near Willow School. The school did go on lockdown during the incident and um, we were able to resolve things fairly quickly, fortunately, and, and kept the stress and distraction to the school and the residents to a minimum. Police and school district leaders are asking parents to remind their kids of the consequences of carrying anything that looks like a real weapon. And at least two police departments say this, depending on the seriousness of the situation, disorderly conduct charges may be warranted. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.